I did fashion promotions at UCLAM, which is the University of Central Lancashire. Um, I did a year's placement at Marks and Spencers as a buyer. So that was my role. I was going to be a buyer, which is very similar to costume design. I got meningitis and took a year out. So when I went back for my final year, I, I'd been doing odd jobs and I got a walk-on job on the TV series Cracker. And that was it. I saw that side of the role and I asked, oh, how do you do costume? And spoke to the costume designer. And when I left uni, I said I can do a week's work experience. By the second day, I was offered a job and another job. So for me, day to day, um, every Monday, well, Friday, Monday, we get about 14 episodes of scripts. And it's my job to read the scripts and then hold the meetings with the different directors because we have three units, so we have three directors. And then I also have three sets of teams that go out and film. So it's my job to break it down, pull out all the costume items that relate to us, shop, maybe refit some of the principals and the new guest artists that come in, and hold the meetings, make sure the teams are ready to go out filming in the two weeks after we've just read them, then we read again. If you have an interest and you're good with people, if you're good with people and you can sell, you can do little alterations, then this is a job that you can come into. Don't think you have to do a degree in fashion. You have to start at the boring jobs, which is, you could just be a trainer running in, washing, ironing, hanging up. So when we do assessment days, a lot of the kids who come in, they've done their degrees, they've got a first, and you tell them what their day-to-day is going to be, and they're like, oh, that's not for me, that's not what I want. Every day is different. I could come in in the morning expecting to do maybe receipts or just speak to someone, and I end up doing emergency dash out to go and buy something because a child's come in and they've grown and nobody's told us or somebody's had a disaster where something has been burnt or lost. Um, yes, every day is literally, I'm literally, as soon as I come in, the phone's ringing, we're on it.